Hi. I'm Skycat Live. It's 7.06 p.m. on... It's 7.06 p.m. on 11-17-2023. And uh, it's the MMO Lifestyle. That's a... Uh, <clears throat> Friday night, November 17, 2023, it's 7 p.m. It's a good day to be alive. And today we will, we will be playing some WoW, hopefully some FF, FFXI, and some EVE Online. And uh, don't have much to say today. There's nothing really to weigh in or anything to do. It's a good day. We can just jump into the gaming. I uh, had a great session yesterday. I lost, uh, lost a hardcore character at the beginning of the session. Grinded my way back up for the rest of the session. Now we're back where we were yesterday before I died. And we're about to go to Darkshore. Um, and on FFXI... Uh, let me get rid of the big face here. Uh, <clears throat> on FFXI, apparently I'm having trouble patching the launcher. So now I'm on the Discord trying to sniff out what's wrong with that. Server's live. Let's go to technical support. Launcher isn't updating, and I don't think time is going to fix it. Uh, damn it. What's going on with the launcher here but yeah we appear to have like a pretty bad problem god damn it Damn it, there's always some new fucking problem I've got to deal with every single fucking day. Well, I'm sorry guys, apparently Final Fantasy is down, I don't know. I don't know what causes this stupid ass shit, I don't know what to do about it either. I don't think, uh... I don't know, I really don't know. Let's log out and log in. Log out and remember log in. You cannot patch.
to save this image to download save no save sorry guys gotta navigate the terrible problems that always occur every single day can't can't do my job until i do and got a problem every single day of my life but but these days every ever since i started streamer there's a catastrophic problem every single day when i first start every single day that i wake up there's a catastrophic problem that stops me from doing a complete session every single fucking day every uh, every client every problem all the time Yeah, never mind. I think the server's down in actuality. I think there's people in there, but I think the server's actually down for most of the people because the population's down. Or no, it's not It's not down. They're in, but I'm not. So they get to play, but I don't, I guess. You can see how it's always like me. I'm the one who, know, who, who, gets, who, who can't get in. I want to re-download the launcher. Let's let's do that. Okay, so just go to download, damn it. Yeah. And let's just see if this fixes it. This might fix it. Apparently 11's down today, and, and that just, or at least for me, at least for me, I don't think it is for anybody else, but it is for me, and it's, it's like, Jesus Christ, man, this, this shit pisses me off, every single fucking day, there's some catastrophic problem at the start of the session, every day, for the whole 18 months that I've been doing it, and I, I wake up in the morning, and I'm like, oh man, what's the new problem today? Nah, see, this is fucked up. Anyway, I'm gonna turn it on and just accept that, 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 that I'm down today. And that's just, just fucking great. Fucking great, let me tell you really great just great 
Great way to start the day. Thanks. But I mean, this is how this is how every single day for the last 18 months has started. So I'm used to it. I don't even get depressed anymore. I'm like, what's the catastrophic problem that's going to prevent me from doing my job today? Wake up in the morning. It, it, it does depress me. It depresses me. Because it's a necessity. It has to happen every single fucking day. Some catastrophic problem with whatever program I'm using every single fucking day. I can't think of a day in, in recent memory where there wasn't one. Every single day. Every client I use. Piece of shit software problems. Private. Real. Pay for them. Don't pay for them. It doesn't matter. They all crash. All of them. They all have problems. God damn it, man. but i mean what else is new I'm so used to it i was like oh man I, like most days i get up and there's not a problem <laughs> and there is there always is a couple hours later or where it's head or whatever but in the in the in the in the ignorant time when you think that there hasn't been a problem yet or there isn't going to be a problem and then, then then inevitably there is uh like fucking <laughs> like in that in that ignorant time you're like Oh man, uh, it's a day without a fucking catastrophic problem, and then it hits, and you're like, oh, that's what it is. Yeah, can't log into this client, or can't log into that client, or, or any of this stupid shit. You, I mean, it's just so stupid. What happened here? Did you close the client? I didn't actually want you to do that. Oh god. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. Oh, there we go. There we go. It finally connected after the 11 try. But hey, we got the catastroph catastrophic problem gone, probably. That's good. That's good. I was like, yeah, cool. Why am I having to restart this launcher 45 fucking times? The fuck are you talking about? It's funny because the minute that I, I posted a known issue or whatever. Delete post. Yep. There we go. And uh, it looks like it is patching. That's good. Fucking annoying. Like, and thanks for wasting my time and make me do all that. So, hi, guys. Let's get our, let's get our day started. Uh, the catastrophic problem hit right away in the first, like, three minutes. So, it really was kind of getting to me. And I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be so negative. It's just, this is what my life is often like. You wake up every single day. Now, wh what happened here? You, you went to something that's really far away. Oh, my God. Where am I? I'm in the one asteroid that's far away. Jesus Christ, just go to that one or whatever. Yeah, just go to that one. It's fine. Just unlock all of these. and Yeah, unlock. And we'll just put everything on, on, on this guy except for these. go okay so much better sorry it's just i woke up to, to the, you want to know the fastest way to ruin my day wake up to either launcher or client problems in the first five minutes which granted happens every single day of my fucking life it happens every single day of my life i can't think of a day in the, the recent memory where it didn't happen some problem with some client i mean it happens days without problems but it's really pretty rare when you run four clients, you got four times the amount of problems and, uh, or whatever, three, three. And, uh, yeah, it's just not too fun. Game is ready to play. That's good. Hey, so we can at least play the games that I normally plan to play. And the catastrophic problem didn't take down even my daily, like my daily routine. You know, my daily routine is often completely in jeopardy because of how bad the software is. I'm frank, frankly being very real often my daily day is at risk to bad software developers hey cool updated nice yep, good okay let's look around for a tiger and we can get to it hey so let's do some ffx size some wow and some eve i think that's gonna be amazing i think that's like what i came here to do let's kick some ass 
why scanning up a nice tiger that's closer by than that yeah uh i know there's probably one to the east huh yeah there's one to the east uh to the east there's a tiger right there we're gonna use them to eat birds birds i have uh 3600 out of 6k which is good i'm gonna try and get a level today get to level 33 Sooner or later, we'll get a, we'll get dismissed, which makes my job so much fucking easier. Because I can just drop mobs that, that are low, that are going to attack me or whatever. Or I can tame or, tame or drop them. I should two-hour this tiger, technically. But it would be better if I could do an EM. But, I mean, decent challenge just is fine. I mean, it's kind of a waste of a two-hour. I think I'll wait. I'll wait until I find an EM tiger. That's good. Get on him. Dot him up. Okay, so we ran to Denalin. We did that. Um, the Relics of Awakening. No, I don't want to do that. I want to go in... I mean, I could do Relics of Awakening, but I don't want to. It's fine. Okay, now that we got that, we're gonna buff. <coughs> Let's load a video. Uh, history. Heard of this guy? I can't seem to find any chalk. <laughs> oh, the new steak and eggs hit. You know, I already know all this stupid stuff. Let's go listen to that. Thank you, Steak and Eggs Podcast, for the excellent content from your stream. I'd like to sub to your channel. Hello, everyone, and welcome yeah. to episode 37 of the Steak and Eggs Podcast. I'm Emmy, and I'm with Asmin and Techie, as always. And today we have a lot of fun stuff to talk about, a lot of video game stuff, a bunch of new stuff getting announced. We've all been playing WoW. It's been really fucking fun, at least for me. I, I hope everyone else has been having fun. No. <laughs> no? No. Well, you made your own video no. with like 10,000 fucking sims in it. That's right. That's right. They're going to do everything for me. You guys know how the promotions of my guild work? I actually don't know anything about your guild. So you <laughs> talk all about it. Well, I know it's called Roach Out. It's Roach Out, and then we have a second guild called Roached Out. Uh, I don't know where, really how we did that. I probably should think of a better name. <laughs> and uh, basically, everybody gets invited into the guild, and uh, it's real simple. Everybody's the same. Everybody's a cockroach rank, right? Yeah. And then you can pay, this is interesting, five <laughs> gold. Oh, it gets better. Five <laughs> gold to an officer, and then they will promote you to the next rank. Okay. Ten gold is the next rank after that. Wait, so is it like you can skip by paying 10 or you have to pay 15 total to get to the second tier? I, I, I don't even know. Oh, okay. I didn't set this up. I, Wait, I, uh, well, how much money to get to the max rank? Uh, well, I mean, that, that's... Oh, I don't even know. Uh, like somebody, maybe he was trying to offer like thousands of gold. To no, get wait. Officer rank. I, I went the wrong way. I don't know if it's going to happen or not. Yeah. And then we have a... I forgot that I better, just though, did this. The best part is that if you are at a higher rank, you can pay 20 gold to have one of the roaches in the guild, the low ranks, snipped. Aggro. You just get them booted? You get them kicked out of the guild. You pay 20 gold to get somebody kicked out of the guild <laughs> if they're at the low rank. And so that encourages people to pay gold to obviously kick people out of the guild, because fuck them. And then also it encourages them to pay gold to get out of the rank that they can get kicked out of the guild for. Wait, so why would anyone want to join this guild? What? Why, why would you know? Yeah, why, why, why would you join just to get abused and, and pay gold? What else are you going to do? Oh, okay. Yeah, what else are you going to do? Like, I mean, at, least, at least there's something <laughs> okay. going on, right? I mean, like, fuck. <laughs> like, wow, is it's, it's fucking boring. Like, you might as well have to know this. We had our first guild meeting, and we had we killed somebody in celebration of it, which was actually we killed two people. Wait, how did you kill them? Oh, we had a Mount Garah. Oh. Uh, yeah, we just had them kill each other. And uh, that you was fun. You Pokemon battles with the brooches? Uh, yeah, yeah, we had a level, uh, level, his, uh, his name was, uh, what's his name? Uh, fucking Caspio or something like that, uh, Curspio, and, um, the guy got killed 
doesn't yeah. even know his name, well, and he remember. died for his entertainment. Yeah. <laughs> I was trying to remember what the name is, and uh, I've I've read it like fifty fucking times because like everybody was spamming his name was Caspio, but um yeah that that happened. It was really fun, and we made a second guild even. That way uh, we could get more money. I think that's smart. The yeah. roaches the roaches yeah. have been good to me. Yeah, they follow me around Stormwind and they call me Baldy. Uh huh. And it's nice, you know. I have company. Right. <laughs> yeah, it's good. And they say, "Where's Asmund?" Mm -hmm. And I say, but I don't fucking know. I'm not here. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's normal, right? I mean, like, yeah, yeah I, I've been I've been leveling, and uh, that's well, been basically about it. Well, I'm not really leveling, right? I've been getting power leveled the whole time. That's the same thing. My day. my plan is to I want to put in as little effort to this as possible. I want to just not even. I'm like I was even thinking about some, putting somebody else on follow and then having them mob tech. Very good. Very good. No, I just, to, just so I don't have to do anything. I think that's a good call. Yeah. I mean, why the fuck should you? Exactly. You've already beat the game a hundred times. Yeah, it's I've already done this before. Like yeah. I'm just trying to get sixty. Straight up. Yeah, you know, I just wish they add a sixty boost into the store, Blizzard, please. I so know. hardcore? Yeah. 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 That way, it's just like it's easier, so like, I don't have to worry about leveling if, and stuff. If you now. reach sixty once. Yeah, well, you're not gonna get it the second time. Like, just, no, I know I get what you're saying. Yeah, for me, I, I'm tired of all these fucking purists who are yeah. like, "Oh my god, you mob tagged! Oh my god, you bought necklaces! Oh my god, you bought ZTs!" People are making Reddit threads about me. Yeah, they're really upset. What about they say? Wait, they that say? you're getting power level? What about the just everything about me? Like, basically, they're mad that I'm on the server. They're mad what? because so many people went on the server because I went on the server whenever we had the events. Uh, people said that they lagged and died, which is like, you probably didn't lag and die because of me. You just sucked. Yep. Number two, number one. Number two, they're also mad because of the guild structure. They're really upset about that. They said the guild's pay to win. It is. <laughs> yep. It's pay to win. Well, uh, it doesn't affect them. They don't have to join. Well, yeah, but um, they're probably already in the guild. Or they probably oh. got they probably got snipped, you know? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah there you down. go. <laughs> and uh, yeah, no, it, it, yeah, people are really mad about that. And guild, also mob tagging. Is this on your Reddit? Oh yeah, we banned some people, but like there were a few threads about it, and there so was like YouTube how comments. the fuck do you have a hate thread on yourself on your own Reddit? Is that normal? Well, yes, I don't know. that is. I I see that all the time. What the? F that's insane. I don't even. To me. I don't even follow that many streamer Reddits, but they get re recommended to me like Nick or XQC or whoever. So why would their you own just... viewers post hate threads on them all the time? Why wouldn't you just ban those people? I do. Oh okay. Th that, I, they do get banned, yeah. but the, the threads usually get left up for like five, ten, whatever yeah, five hours. Five hours. Yeah. yeah. Something like that. I mean, that, that's that's insanity. Uh huh. This walking into someone ha someone's house and then shitting on the floor. <laughs> yeah, it's like, yeah. Bro, well, no, but you have to know that these are people that are like obsessed with them. So like they like hate love them, right? They're like, I love them, but they're not yeah, doing what I, I want them to do. Yeah. So I'm pissed. Pretty much yeah. is what it is. It's really cringe. It was really cool because uh, I have played gacha games for like three and a half years. Streamed MMO maybe like twice. I received absolutely zero pushback from streaming MMOs. There was nobody complaining. Nobody bitched. Nobody said play Honkai. Nobody said play Genshin. Nobody gave a fuck. They're just like, wow, this is pretty cool. Man, you're having fun, huh? Because I've been treating it like a podcast. I yeah. boot up the game, I get in a call with eight of my buddies, and then we just talk for the next 16 hours straight. I do that, except for there's nobody else except for me. Yeah, I you just talking? sit there and talk. Yep, that's yeah, what I do. I talk. Like three hours. I don't need a Discord. What? I don't need 16 uh, people. No, no, I'll just talk. <laughs> yeah, he's going to win 100%. Yeah, no, gonna no. no. I didn't, well, he's, I didn't no, he's not know. running. He's winning. Um, it's, yeah, he's gonna run, then he's gonna win. Yeah, there's, there's like, there's no, there's no one else. Like Sleepy Joe, he probably slept through the, you know, the the sign up phase. Or... Sign up phase. <laughs> <laughs> sign up phase. Yeah, he's like, what's going on? Draft, yeah. what? <laughs> I think it'll be so fucking funny, and people get so mad about it. That's the thing is, like, I told people like. I want my guild chat. I want people to be fighting about politics in my guild chat. I, I do. Want people to be I like, like politics. Yeah. Like using profanity, getting angry. Yep. At each Fuck other. Trump and. I want it yep. to be like a real fucking clown show. Yep. I, I basically because I look at it because I knew that whenever I started playing the game, it would bring a lot of people in, right, from like the server. Absolutely. And I thought to myself, if I joined y'all's guild, like I'm gonna ruin your guild. I'll ruin the guild. Uh, he would. I will, because like a lot of people will come <laughs> like, messaging you guys, and they'll no. be like annoying. Oh yeah, yeah, it'll be really bad. It might not bother you, but like some random fucking normie streamer that gets invited into this shit, and then they have fifteen people messaging them. Where's Asmon Bald? Like, no <laughs> ass. like, who are you? Like, you're irrelevant. Like, you're fat. Mm. Like, just randomly, yeah. and it's like I have to be kind of like the uh, the, yeah. the lich king for these uh, these animals. 
and so I keep them all to myself. That makes yeah. sense. Yeah. I think the only people that actually it's a service. The only, and I shouldn't be saying this on podcast, but I don't care. The only people who really piss me off are the people who flood my inbox with chunks of meat. That way I can't receive more inbox mail. Mm-hmm. And yeah. they're taking away no, it's fucking infuriating. I'll wake up and I'll have hundred and twenty chunks of boar meat in my mailbox and I can't receive anything. It's so fucking irritating. That is annoying. Other than that, people who follow me around and be dickheads and chat, I think it's hilarious. I feel like people need to loosen up. I think that like it's just it's not a big deal to me, right? And and it's all like entertainment and everything. Like I don't think I mean, do you think y'all are ever gonna do molten core or the forty man race? Yes. I think that the guild will, but I feel like a lot of people that are currently playing will not make it. How many streamers? Including myself potentially. You don't think you're gonna? You're gonna make it. I I feel like I genuinely don't know, cause like I I do want to like one boss in molten core to me. I I don't know. She's not gonna make it, guys. Am I supposed Sorry. to study up now? Well, I mean, I would just be aware of it, you know. Like, I mean. Isn't well? Isn't forty the halfway point? Should I be preparing isn't this 40 early? Forty the halfway? I don't know. I mean, it's like uh, XP wise. Forty three. Forty three. Yep. Yeah. I have no idea. I'm not even halfway there. Some say so. forty three. Some say forty seven. I don't know how the fuck that's possible. It doesn't even are. matter because the yeah. ceiling is totally different. Like it's a, it's just a numerical break point. Well, did, did you not see our our guild meeting? Soda was uh. I mean, I don't know why he did it during that meeting because I don't think anyone's gonna Sam, remember. But he was, he was already trying to teach us like uh, trash mobs and bosses Under for upcoming uh, name, name one of them. There's the one that looks like Nasus that yep. has the curse. Yep. There's the, Nas- the, wait, who's Nasus? Nasus from League of Legends, big dog, big Anubis. Yeah, Anubis. Dog, big dog, big dog. Okay. the curse. Okay, what's the curse do? Is it pulse, just the one pulses that, out. Yeah, pulses out, and it can and do like stack. two thousand damage. And then there's another boss where you have to stand in groups of five, uh, four, five groups of four because like it like ricochets. And, Very like, good, and Emmy. And there's this big Very good. Flies at someone and one shots them. I'm proud of her. There's these dudes in these airplanes that fucking explode if you don't kill them fast yeah, enough. Yeah, And uh, he skips some of the other mobs because he was like, I don't even know who this is. And I was like, wait, what the fuck is going on? So basically I don't remember anything. Mm-hmm. Go for Gurabashi bat riders is what you're talking about. Yeah. Yep. And people die to them every day. And you, you, you can drink. Level, what's so funny to me is to watch somebody who's level 60 and you see all their gear is enchanted and everything and just to see them fucking die just out of nowhere to some just boom. Is yep. 18 years old. Yep. It's brutal. It's hilarious to me. I, I, God, that's brutal. It, I'm not going in a raid. No. Us, like, you need I can do it. I don't have, have no interest. To detect the roaches so that yeah. they don't pull all the other mobs. Oh, dude, when I'm in RFD and I see roach aggro, I'm like, oh, God, yeah. find that bitch. Shoot him before he gets out. And then also there's what? There's roach aggro in there. And I don't, there's scarab aggro in Zulfarak, which you're about to do. Have you ever done Zulfarak ever? No. You're gonna love it. It's one of my favorites. And there's this moment where you're on top of this staircase and this wave after wave of like undead troll come up. It is so cool and incredibly stressful. Yeah, no, I'm. I mean, I'm excited, but I mean, that's the next big I'm, moment. I'm not overconfident, is what I'm saying. I, I will say this: ZF is the next big moment where you might die because if somebody fucks up <laughs> in the staircase, you're not gonna do it with Nez, are you? Oh no. There's not that many other people around my level. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, well, I mean, it is what it is, right? Well, there's actually a lot who can help you. There's Jimmy. Jimmy's been great to party with. Yeah. He's been re- Jimmy's the only reason why I'm playing Classic WoW. Uh-huh. Jimmy's been really good. Uh, I just hit 45. Um, Corey is doing great, but sometimes he overpulls because I think he gets bored. Uh, and then there's Lava, really good. I actually think we have a lot of very strong players, like very strong players. Yeah, I think that there's a high chance that it does make it to Molten Core, but it, yeah, I don't know how many. I can't like, buy this gear. I can't do it. Well known streamers will make it there. Probably gonna be. Uh, I need better. No, I don't. Oh uh, yeah, I need more well. potions than this though. Yep. yep, that's gonna be about it. I'll be. Damn, I, 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 I think that. I mean, I'll probably get sixty. I will go to y'all's raid. If you want, I will. I will go to the. Yeah, raid. he can go to the raid. I will participate. He's will not participate. bad. Yeah. As yeah, we He's done it recently. Yeah. Yeah. I've not done yeah, it recently, and I don't care. No, you, you couldn't. <laughs> you couldn't pay me to care about this shit. I was. I was more hardcore than these people back then. We did more. I that guy Bagon who did my tacticians guide. 
Uh, so my my tacticians run through of uh, Baldur's Gate three where where we we smashed every boss first try right. That guy, uh, <clears throat> he had lore master in two thousand and eight. Which means he had done every quest in the game. He had Seeker and Lore Master by, by 2008. Most people didn't even know that 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 fucking like achievement existed, and a lot of our people were were like sweatier than these guys were, and then event and some of them were streaming and too busy to be to be like paying attention to stuff. But like, so like like I'm not scared of though. I'm not scared of BWL or BRD. I've done it so many thousands and thousands of times. I'm not scared of it. I know every inch of it to heart. I could tell you what every bit of it does. I'd have I would need visual cues to remember the names, but I would know everything. I know I can tell you what Neff does, you know, like uh, all of them, like what to do on each boss, all that stuff. And so like uh, the raids don't scare me. What scares me is is a mob turns and one shots you, because that's what happens. That's what WoW was. That's what, that's what made it so fun. A, a, a fucking mob turns. So so like I like I guess now tanking tanking wise, the tanks are a lot better and don't let the fucking like the the mobs run off. But it used to be real WoW was like a mob turns and one shots you, and now you got a five minute run. Before you can fade, before you can do. I mean that's what WoW actually is. I mean, I'm not kidding. That's what Asmongold would say. It's a it's a mob turns and one shots you for no fucking reason. Nothing. You might not even be running a rotation. You just somehow bump on the meter because you're dots or something like that. And a mob turns and one shots you before you can even even like contest or run a defensive or an evasion or something. It just and that's what WoW is. So anybody willing to step in a raid really, really, really trusts the people that they're with to do their jobs and stuff. And this exists in WoW, but you couldn't pay me to do it again. These people, they never stop playing WoW. They don't want to stop playing WoW now. They want to keep playing WoW, and they just want to play WoW. I am. I do not share that. I don't share that at all. I'm actually kind of unhappy that I'm here right now. I'm just. I'm glad that I'm obsessed with something so much that it's it's compelling me to play the game. But I'm not even really happy that I'm here, to be honest, because it's like I did this so much that you know, like I I I like that I have the passion to try and get 60 hardcore in a legitimate way with no grunt, no grunt, no 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 boosting or any of that shit, right? I'm I'm and if I do it, I might do it again over and over again but and and I'll, I'll think I'll, I think I'll think myself blessed that I found something that I was passionate about and that I have an interest in right but I would I would just as much be happy if I just like signed out right now and didn't didn't come back these some of these people they want to just be playing the game for the rest of their lives they don't they don't want to like they're not thinking about other games they're just you know this is their passion this is what they do I never had that even in the background I was playing okay at the same time that i ran to within 15 points of gladiator uh and um <clears throat> uh you know what else uh uh i was in a guild that opened the gates of encourage and i was there for all that like i witnesses two people in my life that can ver come verify right now i was there for all of it and like all this stuff and in that time i also went to sniper on two different battle like level 50 sniper uh, uh, um, uh, general, five star general on 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 Battlefield 1943 at Battlefield Bad Company, and uh, I was also playing all the single player games coming out on the Xbox 360. I was a I was an extreme rock band uh, contender on the world stage, like like on the leaderboards and stuff. All this stuff. I was in college. And I was doing all of this stuff, right? And, like, so this thing about I want to play WoW and only WoW for all my life. And I know all the bosses and I know what they do. And I call people scrubs and balds and I'm a boomer and that's all I want is WoW. That's so far from who I am that I can't relate. And, and frankly, one of the things that, you know what, you know what the biggest mental barrier for, for, uh, for WoW Hardcore was for me? Is when I landed this in, it's not the death it's, it's not looking bad. It's it's not confirming to my stream that I'm bad or any of that stuff that I knew was going to happen because it, because hardcore is one of the harder things, actually, I think that I've ever done. Uh, 
not hard, but just being able to focus on it. I in, in this fragmented fucking culture of six second uh, attention spans, I knew that my attention span was the greatest enemy, and my my other and well not my great okay, my greatest enemy was as I walk in this in right now. There's this seductive pull for me. Like so, as I walk in this in, what do you think is my greatest desire to do? Right? What do you think's running through my mind? You'd be kind of surprised, I bet. I walk in this in, and I and and, and my real struggle is is I know that two button presses away is an exit game. Right here. And I think about it, and I'm like, oh man, I could just not do this to myself anymore as I arrive in Dark Shore the first time. This is the real problem. I could just exit this game and not do this to myself and focus on other games that I think are much more fun, much more random, and much more better. And just don't take you to the same places that much. They do, it, but they don't take you to the same places all the time. They don't really do that. Uh, I need to look for tigers, and I'm looking for higher level tigers. So now we're going to inspect the tigers. Well, really, I'm just going to two-hour a tiger in my neighborhood and just use it and get the two-hour on timer because it's dumb to let it just sit up there. So that exit game thing is a problem, and I have a problem with exit game, too. I'll just straight... I, like, one of the things I had to learn was if I want to do all of this shit full-time, that exit, that exit game button is my best friend. Go do something else. All the time, I would tell myself that. On Rust, I would just exit game. I'd just be like, nope, bad loss, bye. Back in a couple of hours. Bad, you know, going to go jack off or, or something. I don't know. I'm just, just not going to do this right now. And so the exit game became my best friend. And so now the biggest struggle for me is not dying in the water yesterday or dying to Link or, or bullshit-ass, cock-ass, fucking motherfucking repop and, and uh, you know, pop aggro. It, it's not my biggest problem. My biggest problem is knowing that that exit game button exists and not just firing it off every single time I have some adversity. That's actually the real challenge for me. And these people suffer from that just as bad as I do. I know they do. I share that in common with them. They all know the exit game button is there and they're tempted to use it. Even Emmy is like fucking tempted to like just exit game. Trust me, it's it's just it's in them. They know it. They don't have to do this. They're successful. They're they're probably rich by my standards anyways. And they're just, you know, especially Asmongold. It just, you know, <clears throat> they don't have to do this i don't have to do final fantasy 11 i don't have to do eve i don't have to sit on this belt i don't have to sit here in this inn and and fear whatever quests are gonna get like you know uh you know is, is gonna cause me a problem i don't know what to do uh So now I run around and I take quests and I think I do the fishing quest uh, just to get me the chunk that'll get me to 12 because I came here a little early. I did not want to go back. Oh, no, I do have to go back. I have to go back. Son of a bitch. I have to go back. I have to go back. It's faster to take the flight master back to Darnassus and run where I have to go than it is to, to Hearthstone, I think. I came here prematurely, but there is a rogue quest that I should do because the, the weapon quest is good. It's, it's, I forgot about the weapon quest and I made a tactical mistake because see my heart's not that in it and my, it's, it's hard for me to dedicate to this. I have so many other things I want to do that it's so hard for me to do this, but I do like the addiction. I think it's good. I think I've been doing it too much, like starting to clock out all day, every day in lost runs is probably really dumb i know that i'm just as inclined to play beastmaster as i am this hardcore run and that's how serious you can tell i'm taking it and that's kind of annoying uh and, you know it just is it is really that'd be awful. fucking awful that would be so funny i'll have to figure out a way to do it nobody notices that would be Make a video about it a year later Oh, that would be fucking miserable. I'm actually very attached to my character. Yeah? Like, I would actually be devastated to die to some bullshit. I don't even remember what my character's name is. Uh, Classic Plus X. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yep. I've been saying this. I 
I'm sure that people will mess up in the raids, and Soda's gonna analyze it. I do not, like, I do not envy those streamers that are gonna be in that position. I yep. mean, maybe I'll be one of them. Yeah, exactly. Know. You could, you could, you could die. Okay, yeah. well, just, you're not gonna buff during combat. Yeah, well, uh, the big thing is, I didn't realize how big of a deal it was until after that, because no one told me that it generates threat, which is, like, more important than the mana thing, I think. Yep. But, I mean, now I know, so. It's, it's very hard to know things that you don't know. Very yeah, it's hard. There's a lot of it's, things in Classic WoW that are like instant death mechanisms, yep. and you're only going to know them when after happens, you die. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Like, like for example, I've had three close calls so far. Uh, one, I was in Stranglethorn Vale. There was three mur murlocs underwater. They're all casting lightning bolt at me. I go to LOS behind a pillar. The pillar just doesn't LOS. Yeah. It just, they just go. It's they, the they one just under, it's the, like the ruins. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And they're just shooting through it. And I'm like, oh, great, so I can't charge them because they're underwater. Right. I'm slow, I can't get to them. Something like that happened to me with Murlocs, too. I went behind a fucking hill, and they were shooting me through the hill. Yep. Oh, yeah, yeah, they can do that. Yeah, it has to be, yeah. like, hard LOS, like a rock or something. Yeah, yeah. and it's, it's fucking insanity. Yeah, two so casters, I, run, I just run. Um, the only reason why as I'm a rogue, like, 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 as a hunter, you might be able to be okay. Okay, so as a hunter, you might be able to be okay because you can sick you can sick the pet on both of them fairly quick. You can get the hunter's pet on both of them, and if you have an initiated aggro on the second target or or even third, you can put the pet on both. But the pet will die at that point. So, but at that point, you can disengage or feign death and maybe maybe just get out of it if you're lucky, and then just run rogue if you get two casters you have to have a vanish or a sprint you can't be underwater because you can't sprint I, had to, I like i realized yesterday that going in the water as a rogue is just fucking stupid without vanish you, you just can't get out of the situation fast enough you can swim for your life and you can maybe make it i did it i did it two times before i did die but it's still not very it's a shaky premise for a rogue to get to, to get out of water situations so it, you i mean it it, it it now rogue is actually probably the easiest one to get out of it well not easiest but one of the easiest because they have shadow step but it didn't used to be like i mean it didn't now like what i'm doing right now you don't have shadow step so it's it's a little bit of a of a of a of a barrier water for a rogue. I didn't really realize how bad it was. I didn't think about it tactically like that. You have nowhere to run without vanish. There's nowhere to go. There's no L no L L O S. You can't swim faster. You can if you use a potion, but you can't like you can't swim faster of your own volition. You you have to deal with it. So oh shit, do I have to do this? I think I do. I have to train this, don't I? Yes, I do. And it's fucking five silver. Fuck. I'm poor again. I might have to grind just for money to, to have the survivalness that I need to, to per, 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 like perhaps keep this push going. I need to grind somewhere until my inventory is full. I think because... Or just run the beach. I'll have to... I, I, I should run the beach south and only kill crabs and look for fishing spots because I can fish those. I have, the, I have a high enough level. And then go sell the mats and, and within two hours I'll have the money to, to, to buy all the survival stuff I need. But like for instance, I need lesser healing and, and even this is just going to wipe me out. Yeah, oh, I mean, I, I can't even reach it, I don't think. Yeah, yeah, I can't reach this. Maybe I can reach it, let's see. I don't think so, no. Oh, no, I need you cheaper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't think I can reach this. That's unfortunate. It's like, yeah, they really know that these are selling. Yeah, these are selling big time more people like but as my came to the server the heal, the healing pots oh i mean i i kind of need this i sort of need this but i don't i don't have look even the singles have been bought the people are buying the singles because they're like i'll make one last and they're and they're right i don't know yeah this is it this is all there is of these for sale that's i'm gonna take what i can reach just so that I mean, I don't know. It seems like such a ripoff. It is it is a ripoff. That's a ripoff. I'm not doing that. So, this was a waste of time, but that's alright. I do have to do the rogue quest, though. I have this rogue quest that I've got to do. Yeah, that guy. I have to go do that. So, and I have to, because it's like the only free weapons upgrade that I can get. And it's crucial to my success here in Darkshore. If, if I catch two mobs and I can't kill them, I'm out. I'm done. I can't. I can't. I can't um, survive. So, 
and I guess, yeah, I guess the next thing I should do technically is go break my bank. I'm going to break my bank because I, I fucked up and I didn't send the gold when I died yesterday. And that was a fuck up. I needed that gold so bad and I was so stupid. I didn't send it. And so, yeah, like, like we're, I mean, yeah, like, like I have no money here. Yeah. I've got like what? 30, 30 silver. I'm going to, I'm going to fucking send it. going to send all of it. I'm going to send 28 of it. Yep, right, right out, and and that'll help me reach my goals. I have to, if I have any hope of making this character last, I have to. Oops. Gotta love, uh, mining in a Mac in 2023. It's it's such good yield, and it's and it's cheap, and it pays for itself, and it, it's it's just like the best mining has ever been. It's definitely better. So, yep, yeah, went, went to the bank, sent the silver. I like this game, though. This is the best ro roguelike I've ever played because it's the only good one. It's, like, the only good game roguelike I can think of beyond Spelunky or, like, EVE Online. It, it's, it's definitely unforgiving it's 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 um it's not it's not forgiving it's it's not a forgiving mode it, it definitely will punish you for the smallest mistakes i realize lately maybe that i'm doing it too much and that's causing the deaths maybe a little bit you get so you get you get like well i think maybe i should set like an eight hour timer and when it's up i should go play a different game maybe or something like go play new world or something i feel like wow classic hardcore is gonna kill new world which is just such a like weird thing but frankly i'd rather be better at wow classic hardcore than new world and that's really weird i mean well i know why because i've capped out both games and i have been successful in both both uh spheres and i don't and i have nowhere to go on either game except for wow hardcore I, I do need to prove that i can do it again i've done well i've done hardcore to 60 when i was younger before so i'm gonna do and i'm gonna do it again and i'm not a for i'm not a foreign this is not a stranger to i'm not a stranger to this i'm not a stranger in this town but i also lack the discipline i've always lacked the discipline i was a like fragmented person always doing texts and talking to girls and playing games on the other screen and stuff i, I don't uh I don't have it. I don't have the discipline to do this. I'll be the first one to admit. So I just try to not die. That's just... And I'm gonna die. That shit they're talking about with the Murlocs, that's gonna kill me. I need to be super paranoid about the quests I do. I'm nervous about this quest, because this quest can get you killed. But, but I mean, I mean, with, with the cooldowns, you're fine. It's set up for rogues to get away if, the first time. But if I fail at it, I, I have to... Uh, I have to, like, leave and wait five minutes. Like, I have to. Ursula the Mauler? I mean, can't you solo that? That's a level 12 quest. I don't need Ursula the Mauler. I don't care about that. Aggro. Yeah, see? I suppose one of the ways this leather can benefit me right now is another 32 armor. Like right now, my armor is like I don't look at the I don't look at the skill stuff and the stuff that like like I mean they don't even tell you your fucking stats. It's insane. There, oh no, there we go. Uh, armor is 265, right? I can improve that right now, and I'm going to because it's just stupid not to. It's a waste of the armor kits, but you know it's fine. That was uh something. What the fuck was that? Oh, he's killing the sergeant. Yeah, nice. It's a paladin thief. Interesting choice. I'm gonna take this to the next bird or whatever. Yeah, that's fine. Just go east, I suppose. There's another bird. I want to feed the bird into the bird. I'm gonna gather mono while it does that, and then I'll use I'll use the tiger to kill the bird when it decharms or whatever. Wait, now what was this? You you aggroed? Oh my god! I don't know what to do here. Okay, I need you to get on him. Yeah, come get him. And when the bird dies, yeah, when the bird dies, I'll just charm the tiger. It's fine. I better heal while I have the the respite. 
My pet's tanking pretty well. Get back on the ball, though. Yeah, and let him... Yeah, let, like, just kill him. It's good. I wish I had Blink. I really wish I had Blink. It's gonna be a long time before I get it, too. It would make this so much easier. Blink and Stone Skin. It'll be 60 or level 60 or something when I get that, though. Okay, here we go. We're gonna charm the tiger. Would have been nice if I got, got a tick and he's gonna resist. Nope, nope, he didn't, and I won. That's very good. And look, the, the bird died fairly quick, actually. <coughs> yeah, that bird shunked him. It's good. All right, now we do get to sit for a while. It's good. Shy, 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 Leah. The asteroid is depleted. Rufus. Die, mm -hmm. you. He dinged off that. I should technically sprint, but I want the cooldown up for, for when I arrive. Which might be in five minutes anyways, I'm slow. I like that the games feel so busy that you actually don't need a distraction. And you can focus on all three. Uh, I don't have doubts about reaching the 60. I have doubts about my fucking attention span. I could reach 60 if I could main this game, but I can't main this game. I, I have too much of a... Of a fucking fragmented fucking personality now. It's annoying. Hardcore taught me that I do not have focus. I cannot focus on Rust. I cannot focus on WoW Hardcore. Not 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 entirely in the main. I'm thinking about other games. I'm thinking about stuff I want to do. Thinking about my stream. Don't care about like don't care don't care to be good at Rust. Don't care to be good at at fucking Eve Online or or anything. I, I don't care. Don't care to be good at anything. My, I'm too fragmented. Don't care about that. I don't care, Sip here. There we go. Why can't I skin all those fucking cats? Stupid cat. Aggro. Dodge. Wish I had slice and dice. Wait, maybe I did get slice and dice. Did I get slice and dice? No. Oh, I did. Nice, nice. Very good. Yeah, we'll get buffs up. We're running into a wall, are we? Oh, I don't know. The tiger is annoying, though. I wish I knew what he was. Let's just familiar him now. I'm, I've wasted, like, already, like, an hour. Let's see what the OBS says. I've been at this, like, yeah, like, like 45 minutes, and I haven't run my two hour. I should have. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to reward him since I, I busted. Go, go. I should get better pet food now, maybe. My, that might be what I should spend this money on. Tuna sushi would be nice, but it's so fucking expensive. When it gets too, too much bandwidth to do Darshore and... Um, oh, come on, man. Are you serious? Spawn, motherfucker. Spawn. Come on, man. Oh, no. There he is. I gotta get out of here before the the uh the ads pop or no i don't know maybe i can just go up there and, and pickpocket him i guess wait he disappeared he disappeared why i don't know but i'm getting out of here if he spawns his mobs i i, I could potentially lose this run you should be here damn it there he is there he is I think I did this once by just letting him walk past me. Yeah, you you have to like set him off and then run back. And he goes, I see you, rogue. See it? And he's like, I see you, rogue. Yep. And when he sees you the first time, 
He's like, I see you, Rogue, and I'm patrolling for you. Or join the others at the bottom of the world tree, right? So then, eventually, he'll pat or something. This is so buggy and stupid. I don't know why they kept this quest in the game, frankly. But now we're going to be patient rather than stupid. And we're going to wait for him to do something. Which is so annoying. Yeah, like there, see? Okay. Uh, don't really want to kill the tiger. But I will take that onion. I want you to come back. Yeah, come back. Good. Oh. Oh, he saw me again, which is so annoying. I don't know. Okay. Got it. Okay. And uh, let's get the fuck out of here. I'm going to use my sprint button for any aggro. Like that. Aggro. Oh, damn it. I don't know. I, I'll skin him. He's, he's worth it. Yeah, like, like I could do more quests here, but I mean, there's really no, like, the, the payout isn't too good past 11. They want you to go to Darkshore. And already as it is, I'm going to have, like, I don't know, 40% into level or something. So then I'll do crabs down the beach looking for uh, fishing spots. And I have to look for fishing pools. I have to. All up and down Darkshore because all my money's gone now. That last 28 silver sent in won't even pay for the training, really. So I have to, like, deal with poverty or lose the character. And that's okay with me, but, you know. But that's hardcore, though. And I like that. It, it feels like Eve. It, it feels like Eve to me. If you're out and you die, you lose the ship. It feels like Eve Online. It's it's. I, I don't know why WoW didn't, wasn't hardcore the whole entire time, frankly. Oh, thank you. Nice, perfect timing. Except that was kind of my, my charm that I killed, but that's all right. Wide scan. We're looking for other tigers. There's a tiger north. That's good to know. I'm full. And I didn't need to go sit down. Nice. I thought he'd hit me. I think... The amount of money that, to level this beast master is going to be insane. The asteroid is depleted. Just insane. The asteroid is depleted. Just insane. Just insane. Why am I 50 fucking K, K in the way or whatever? No, no. You keep flipping the distance for some reason. Why do you keep doing that? So annoying. Okay, so we're at the coast. Um, 
watch what I'm doing. I should have grabbed the tiger and I'm gonna. and I target dummy and I just got fuck out. Uh, then the other time I was in a cave, I thought one of my uh, slaves was inviting me to a party, but it wasn't my slave, it was some random guy who was trying to get me killed. Accepted it, got layered, mm -hmm. and then a boss and six war games are on me. Mm -hmm. Turn around, looking for my buddies, they're not there. Drop a target dummy, get the fuck out. And that's pretty much the end of it. Uh, those are only close calls. Uh, everything else has been incredibly I smooth. Go. And I just, what I'm doing is something crazy. I just don't do anything for content, ever. Yeah. Ever. I don't do content bowls. Every dungeon I do is very methodical, very calculated, and I don't fuck around at all. Because I'm making it to 60, and I refuse to... Oh, I went too far. Dungeon, no matter how much oh. I, do, I refuse. So speaking of making polls for content, Timmy, how did you feel whenever Miz got you killed? Uh, I, I was really fucking sad about that character. But, I mean, yeah, I didn't know that buff would know. Because Soda had told me before not to buff for in the middle of fight. He was like, oh, because you're going to be immune. And I just, like... I, I like wasn't really prepared when the next pull happened and I buffed him when he was like in combat and I was like, oh, but it's not a big deal. I have enough mana. I didn't know it generates threat. So then I had like five or six things on me at one point. I also didn't know that Light of a Loon shares a cooldown with other potions and I had done another pot like five seconds before that. And then because I did my Light of a Loon macro, I was fucking hard things. So I, I got interrupted and then I couldn't heal myself. So it was just like unfortunate ignorant thing after unfortunate ignorant thing but i mean i know now that actually you know? didn't happen exactly uh, <laughs> i watched it so so that guy uh you know that that game orc, is what that, that no that orc that like hit you if you look at the animation on your character you actually were casting a heal and then he there was oh, an he animation interrupted the heal? he interrupted your heal oh it i thought, he, wasn't I thought it was because of me hard things his name is iron patch he's like oh, 45 i didn't know yeah. And, uh, okay. yeah. Well, then the heart wasn't as big of a deal. Yeah, exactly. It was not. I told you. I was. I made a whole video about this. Oh. Yeah. This was. Uh. Holy shit. I feel bad for Gabe's butt. Really? His reputation is just ruined. Well, he doesn't need to worry about that he because he died. died. But he'll come back. He's, I, yeah, I he's can't believe he fucking died and saw Cade's wall in that call. And did you hear his girlfriend in the back like he just died? Yeah. How does that happen? How did he die for a second? Uh, he was playing with Miz, and then he went AFK. And outside of stockades, there's like level 20 mobs that come out. It's like kind of like it's supposed to simulate like a riot, you know, like, oh, all these monsters are going to come out or yeah. these like uh, prisoners are going to come out. And then like the Stormrun guards kill them. Yeah. Right. But if you stand right there, the, those uh, prisoners will attack you before the guards aggro. Oh, them. God. So that's how that's how we got killed. That actually sucks. That's awful. He's level 48. Yeah. yeah, he's back in the game though. I saw him. He's still yeah. grinding. Yeah, and uh, I found it outrageous how Miz was blinding up the forms of mobs that he's about. Well, I think I, I don't find it outrageous because I genuinely believe Miz had no idea what happened. Yeah, well, I, I think he had no idea. I mean, what if, you, really if you watch the clip, the, the guy does like run around the corner, and I was like, what is like, I don't even know why he ran in there. Yeah, but, but he didn't pull anything. It was just Miz pulling all that shit. Yep, he was. Yep. And, uh, I felt pretty bad. I did. I, it's like, especially like dying at 42, like, holy shit, I would be so mad. Yeah, I, I was genuinely curious. considering, like, do I just not play again? But yeah. Then, but then, like, I was like, no, there's nothing to do but just go again. What are you going to do if you die again? Same thing, I guess. Just I don't know. But I, I would feel so bad because a lot of the people that helped me power level back up played, like, the whole fucking time, which was 24 hours for me to yeah. get back to 24. Oh, total, not in one sitting, but total, it was 24 hours. And, like, I, I don't know, I just feel so fucking bad. That's what they wanted to do. And I, you I know, bad. but I just don't want them to have to do it again, is what I'm saying. I get that, but, like, I mean, from my and perspective... And they do have to do it again. <laughs> yeah. Is it, like, that was... They, if they didn't want to do it, they would just not do it. Mm -hmm. Right? They're there because they want to. That's true. Yeah. And, they, and don't be real, that content was fucking awesome. Like, even with Misery level, that was such good content. It is so cool to see WoW Hardcore just getting obliterated with a whole 
raid group leveling up one Yeah, person. I mean, it is boring just, like, watching someone kill the same shit over and over again, but, I mean, it's kind of chill, and then it's, like, nice seeing, like, you know, getting closer to the goal. I think it's chill as fuck. Yeah. I like it a lot. Every single time it's always I didn't mind it at all. Like, I, I didn't hate re-leveling at all. I mean, it is, like, a grind. I'd prefer not to do it, but I didn't yeah. hate it. When you got to 28 HP twice in one fight, that was horrifying. You saw that, right? That, that did happen, yeah. Oh, the yeah. Morgan? Yeah, she was leveling up. Yeah, during and the then battle also, what am I... One of my power levelers almost fucking died because they went AFK and we were doing the Murlocs and they were following someone else in the group and they they were drowning. Oh my <laughs> and god! And then they got to like fifteen percent. Almost to thirty three. Someone else noticed and was like, "Everyone, turn around right now, heal him." And they saved him. And he yeah. almost fucking died. No one noticed he was drowning. That's so funny. There was a level forty eight warlock that was helping me level and he had like fifty nulls on him. And oh he was God. at literally one, like, like you couldn't even barely see his health. And I'm, like, freaking oh, out. Because it's like, this guy's yeah, about yeah. to die because of me. And then he won't be able to power level me anymore. Yeah. This is going to be awful. Yeah. Yeah. And so I'm like, I've got to fucking do something. I fear away one Noel. And he lives with, like, 14 health. Yeah. Yeah. So I actually fucking saved You're him. You're a goddamn hero. I did. And he even messaged me about it. I felt so good about yeah. that. I'm pissed because my one helper that was always there, uh -huh. I can't play with anymore. Why? Uh, he's, he got kicked from Bangsley. Oh, really? And his Guado gang. Bro. Oh, yeah, people were saying that he, like, almost killed someone, like, mm. on accident. I don't yeah, know I mean, he's almost killed happened. me a couple times, but I think he's funny. Oh, man, maybe it was yeah. you. And you know, also, this other guy, uh, yo, Meat, thank you for selling me the Flurry Axe for 100 gold off. There's your shout out, I promise you. But isn't Guado gang also the guy that saved Miz at the end of the tunnel and then right before he died? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I think I think he's got a bad rap. Guano gang giveth and guano gang taketh away. <laughs> I mean, he's got, he is schizo as fuck. That guy yeah. has off the defense. <laughs> Bro types in all caps. Oh. Well, which I do that too. You but talk, it's weird yeah, when he does talk it. You talk in all caps. <laughs> talking all caps IRL. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do. Uh, but I got this new guy called Jimmy Prime. Okay. Bro is convinced he's the son of the light. Yeah. Full RP. Yeah. We're standing out in the rain over in Feralis, and he's like, sir, it's quite wet. May we seek shelter? <laughs> like, as you wish. <laughs> whatever the light, whatever the light commands. Oh yeah, have, there's this one named Murphy who role plays as a Stormwind guard. He's got the Stormwind guard armor, and he just walks everywhere, and he types like a Stormwind guard. That's so <laughs> cool. I think Fangsley is the best part of Hardcore Classic. I don't know if he's in Fangsley, but yeah. Well, the, the, the helpers are the best part of Hardcore yeah. Classic. It seeing is the, so seeing much the same fun. helpers is nice. Yep, it is so goddamn good, and it's we got the new green wall where we can see both skill stats. And they just meow all day. That's good. It's so stupid. <laughs> I don't, don't want to see so that. So good. <laughs> oh my god. I love it. The RPers, man. And uh, we we now have code words to where when we ever go to the bathroom, we have to call it the litter box. Oh yeah, I got punished twice for that yesterday. I did not. I, I lost. Refused. I'm back to zero DKP because of it. Oh. Thing I need in the guild, and I don't give a fuck about the litter. I just want uh, the raptor mount, and I'm thinking SKP will help me get that. Really. Raptor Mount would be fucking sick. That would be cool. That or Baron Rivendare's Charger. That's not going to happen. Yeah, well. It's a 0.02% drop chance. Yep. Okay. Sure but I imagine how cool it be if I did get it. It would be crazy if you got it. <laughs> yeah. It would be fucking crazy. And the thing is, I can do it infinitely. Yeah. So why wouldn't I? Well, you can't do it infinitely. <coughs> because you can only do one run realistically an a hour. A day or a, is it only an hour? Right. Yeah. How many hours? I mean, how many runs are you going to do? As many hours as there are until I die. Okay, well, that's probably probably not that long. Character will die pretty quick. Uh, I won't die. All uh, right. I am. I am. I've taken every precaution. I have every piece of. Oh God, this sounds really cool. Oh God, this could age really badly. Like every being like, oh, I'm so happy I made it to forty. I just got my mount. I'm dead. Yeah. I didn't even have my mount for two levels, and I, I finally got my mount again. Yes. Oh God, and I hope this is age poorly too. I kept. I kept. I kept not even remembering to use it because I'm so. I wasn't, I never even got to get used to having it. Yeah. I, I still just block places because I forget that I have it. Yeah. Just put somebody on follow and they take me wherever I want to go. You know what, fuck it, there's no way I've died. There's no fucking yeah. way. I'm not no way stupid. I would never die. Okay. There's no way. Because I've gone half damage gear, half tank gear. Right. And that's how I level. I have this chest piece where anytime I get hit, I have a 3% chance of healing for 100 which is insane. Oh, yeah. I love that shit. And then I have, nice. I already have my Lionheart helm. Just build breastplates or whatever? Yep. Yeah. And then I have my Lionheart helm. That's waiting for me at 56. 58. 56. You sure? Pretty damn. 
I'm 50, I thought it was 58. Maybe 56. We'll see. I could be wrong. I'm pretty damn excited about it. Yeah. Uh, it looks so goddamn good. 2% hit, 2% crit. Looks good as fuck. And uh, I got my flurry axe. And I'm ready to go, baby. Mm -hmm. I'm ready to lock the fuck in. And I refuse to be top BBS. I will not. Why? First person to die. Okay, that's smart. Yep, I'm gonna say middle of the pack. Wait, for top DPS oh, is yeah, first yeah. person to die? Yeah. Not yeah, a this, healer? So it's like aggro, that's good right? news well, no, for me. No, 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 oh, fuck. Yeah, so it goes tank, healer, DPS. Wait, tank is before healer for yeah, guys? Tank, so Thank God, people mm -hmm. keep telling me healer is most likely to die. Sure. Uh, well, I mean, it depends it, on who your tank is. Oh. I, and I'm, I'm gonna go on record this. I don't think Soda should be main tank. I think he's great. But I think we have Sony and Wake. We should use Sony and Wake as your tanks. I feel like Sony should be trash right. tanks. Uh, and I feel like that should be our yeah, tanks. I mean, Sony, first of all, those are the two sexiest men. Sony in knows what he's doing. Exactly. Yeah. And Wake. Wait, so what makes tanking so much harder than the other classes? Like, you have to, like, react to Nothing. situations? It's really Nothing. Oh. You're the first one to die. You're the wall. You're the tank. Yeah. Because that if you sense. fuck it up, oh, yeah. people are going to die. Is that really there easy. a lot of ways to fuck it up, or not yes, really? Yes, there's a lot of ways. Okay. Uh, yeah, but mainly, I mean, so like, for example, like, if you're like, you'd be tanks. surprised there. I've been with tanks that invent new ways. I didn't even know you could fuck it up this way. <laughs> yeah. Turns like, out you can't. Yeah. Like, like, for example, like, the tank walks around pouring mobs, never hits them. And so he has a bunch of ads on them, and you assume. Oh, and so you assume that they're aggro to them. Exactly. Mind. Like, mm -hmm. when you heal them, and then they all run to you, then you're dead. Yeah, like, when the, pull, when the tank pulls them, they need to fucking hit it. Yeah. Or at least say, Hold up on aggro, don't do anything yet, have it established. That's why comms are really important. Like, that's why you pulled a threat, because a lot of the mobs that you were around on the boat were not hit. So you cast one spell and then over to you. Yeah, I have a threat meter now, so that should, good. That should help too. Good, good, good. And now, a word from our sponsors. Picture this. It's a dark I should get a threat meter day. just for the randoms you that I might be with. House to play Magic the Gathering. But the storm gets you. Now, you're drenched, socks are soaking wet, and you're crying. Water's everywhere. Luckily, with today's sponsor, Messi, a travesty such as this can be completely avoided. Messi has created a series of stylish, 100% waterproof shoes and other clothing that can help turn a rainy day into something to look forward to. Using the power of advanced Dimatech technology, the days of avoiding walking through puddles are over. As the gold, show them. Yeah. Yeah, that's crazy, right? I mean, it's the same thing again. Look at that clean shoe, no water. You can walk through the ocean with those things. What you just saw was the power and elegance of the Soho sneakers and the Alta high tops. In addition to these shoes, you can also snag their overcast jackets, such as Asman has here. They even have an all weather beanie and they even have waterproof gloves. And let me tell you, they look quite snug. And speaking of all this water talk. Do it. <sighs> Messi also makes it their mission to help provide fresh water where it's needed the most. So you're also supporting a great cause. Don't get drenched this rainy season. Become the chosen water bender you were born to be with Vessi. You can visit Vessi.com forward slash steak eggs to grab your own Vessi gear today. That's V E S S I dot com forward slash S T E A K E G G S. Link in the description. Thanks, Vessi, for sponsoring our podcast. I'm also under the firm. I, I, I still can't tell if Ms. Fake this up or not. I believe in Ms. too much. As Miz is my best friend in the whole world. Okay. I, I believe in him too much for him to uh, play like that much of a fucking I don't, you, you, you said you watched Soda's reaction to it, right? Yep. I think he's right that, like, he, in his brain was many conflicting Agro. thoughts, and he didn't want to die, but he, like, wasn't sure what to do, then just ended up trying something that didn't work. Yeah, because the moment he started that quest, he was dead. Absolutely. Now, once again, if he played yeah. properly from the start... He won, but the moment he wastes his intimidating shout, he's just dead. Because he could have, I mean, if you go through it play by play, there was a really easy way for him to live. The moment they come, you pop the intimidating shout, you single target one down for eight seconds, the other two come back, and then it's easy, you know? He also never did a demoralizing shout, he never reduced the damage. Um, he didn't, he, he used retaliation, and he didn't get all the procs for it because he procs it too late when they were running at him. Just like misplay after misplay after misplay. And then when I see him charge back, I'm just like, holy fuck. 
Whenever he did that, I thought to myself, oh no, someone's running out of content. <laughs> no, I, I don't know. I, I, I actually am not certain that he died on purpose because, I mean, Miz fucks up a lot. I mean, I could easily assume it's like kind of a weird thing. Like, everybody says Miz sucks, but then whenever Miz does something that's wrong, everybody thinks it's fake. Well, what do you mean? Maybe that's you a just, good point. Yeah, maybe you just did something stupid. That's not because he is really bad, but I just don't want to believe it. He's, like, he's not that bad. I mean, he's all right. He's just, he's well, who's he, who's he better than? I don't know. I mean, I guess I mean, there's people out there. Okay. Uh, there's got to be people out there. Yeah, probably half the people in my raid. Whenever I raid in, like, Wrath, like, I'd oh. say he's probably better than them. Oh, okay, I was in the Roaches. Yo, the Roaches? I think like, he's, like, just one of those players, and, I mean, there's players like this for every game, where it's, like, they have decent game knowledge, and they could be good. It's just that, like, they, their impatience, or, like, they just choose not to, whichever. They don't whichever. really give a fuck. Yeah, they don't really give a fuck. I understand. Yeah. That's usually how I am. Yep. Uh, there's, there's, there's murmurings going around the guild uh -huh. where people want to make a petition. For what? Me not sucking balls. What do you mean? Everybody who I've tanked for, uh -huh. they want to they wanna sign it and say Tectone did good. Really? Yeah, and then after that, you know what I'm going to do? How, how, how many people are in a position? Like, there's like you and like... Uh, 32. Uh, yeah, there's 32 different people. 32. Wow. Yeah. Everyone's going great. Yeah, I'm no sure he probably tanks fine. Here. That guy's scared of dying. The rest of them aren't. He's terrified of dying. It could, that guy's career it might be might be. They'll cancel him if he dies, and he's terrified of dying. And I'm proud of him. I didn't like him as much as I thought I would. I like him more now because because the the hardest times show who the strongest people are. And that guy didn't die like me. I've died like seven, eight, nine, nine times. Something like that. But then that guy's not playing three clients at once. And I have no viewership, so I don't care. But I mean, if, if, if like, like, you know, so to me, it's just another grind. You know, it's just another grind, like all the others. But this guy's, like, career might be at stake. He Like, if I had anything at stake, if I even had, like, $100 at stake, I would pay way more attention, but I don't care. I don't care. I frankly don't care. I don't care about losing this character. I'll be, I'll be frank about it. I don't care about it. And if I make it, I'll care more. You know. I have thought of how to play safely in a dungeon. Sony came in after we did RFD, told us we did great. Which, by the way, I think I had like a something's wrong with me. Yeah. And he sort of shit talks me so much when he compliments me. I'm like. <laughs> Oh my god. I mean, <laughs> that's how a lot of people move, isn't it? Yeah. It's bad. Yeah, that's just how he is. I like it too much. I like it too much. Uh, but now, Soda taught him about how to DPS properly. So, Kungus is about to evolve. Yeah. He's, for example, he was serpent shotting when they had less than 10% HP. Yeah, yeah. Which is just like, sure. You know, he, put a, he put a damage over time on them, but they were about to die. It was just fucking pointless. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and he would melee weave and hunter. Where he would shoot a shot, walk up, hit him. Oh, you back can up. do that. It works pretty well, but it's like super hard to pull off. Yeah, he wasn't. Yeah, he wasn't pulling <laughs> yeah, it off. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you can do that if you're really good, not if you're new. Yeah. Uh, but now we're gonna teach Seer how to pull. And uh -huh. I and I and I like what Seer Stone is doing. That he's Stone geared up what he thinks is the worst player, so that way if anybody else fucks up, he can be like, "Fucking Seer didn't fuck up. How did you, dumbass?" Yeah, that's a good point. It's yeah. genius. And I called it uh, six days ago. I knew what he was doing. I was like. Why the fuck would Soda give only Seer 2,000 gold worth of gear out of nowhere? Because he wants the ability to shit talk anybody else who fucks up. That's not true. Exactly. It's crazy though that yeah. Seer's completely new and not made it to 45 without dying once. 40. 40? Yeah, 40. I thought he was 45 now. No, he's 40 and then he mm -hmm. logged off because he said, and I quote, I'm not going to play WoW on the fucking weekend. I don't think he's playing today either. Which I really need to because I'm, cause I'm 45 now and I'm gonna, I'm gonna carry him through all Star Monastery again because I'm not stuck right there until I get a fucking tavern because I need Ooh. that tavern so it's the coolest. Yeah. The fucking coolest. We thing. have a rule uh, in my guild that if you're not wearing my tavern, you're kicked out of the guild. Even if they have a Star Monastery one? Yeah, yes. And uh, so there's like a thing, we have a Discord right. channel and it's called Snitches. And uh. so if you post a screenshot of somebody who's like over level 20 in the guild without a tavern on, we just kick them out of the guild. I snitched on those yesterday. For what? I, uh, 
Let's tell the story how much I like the event. You know what I'm saying? So you admit it. Oh, yeah, I've admitted it. <laughs> I've admitted it. So I, I go on to, because whenever an event goes really well and I actually enjoy myself, I like thank the person who invited me. Because I feel like it's just common etiquette. You know, yeah. thank the person who came from the event. So it worked really hard on that event. I said, yo, great event. Fucking awesome. Really cool. Can't wait to see your reaction to Miss Kip dying. And he's like, what do you mean he died? <laughs> and I'm like, oh, 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 oh fuck yeah, dude. Oh, he was yeah, pissed. like, it's crazy because when he died, everyone yeah. was like, hey, we just had a meeting. Let's, like, get the fuck off our computers and leave. So no one knew. Yeah. I, I I felt bad because, like, I'm the one who told Techman, basically. Yeah. Like, we were all out getting food. <coughs> and like, Grayson about the Valorant thing. And he was like, oh, also, like, this just died. And I was like, what? Like, I thought it was just Grayson, like, lying. And I went and looked, and he was dead. And so I was like, I was like, oh, my God. And I was like, what? And I was off the phone, and then I like, just fucking jackass message so right away. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, well, not right know. away, but uh, yeah. That's what I got out. Uh, do, you, do you see the reaction of this? Of everybody's reaction when he saw Mr. Dead? No. Let me see if I can find it for you real quick. Really, really, really good. Uh, let me see if I can scroll up here. This is very important. It is... Da, da, da. Holy fuck, this guild talks too goddamn much. It actually is crazy how many people Classic WoW brought together. Like, everybody's talking, everybody's having fun. Yeah. The amount of good people I've met due to WoW. Well, it's a very social game. I think that's yeah. the reason why. Is that, Yeah, Classic WoW is extremely social. Yeah, it's just, I don't know, man. It's just, it, it makes me so fucking happy. Yeah, I yeah. can't find it. It's on the internet somewhere. Good as fuck. Yeah. Unlucky. Oh yeah, I felt pretty bad whenever I saw Miss die, but it was like that's just what you get. Like he he fucked up. And that's life. Yeah, that's the way it goes. Uh, uh, I'm excited to see more people die. Uh, I'm uh, uh, because uh, roaches have been fighting me today. Uh, thank God just they will kill you. Yeah, my you should not do that. My my you have to understand that like my viewers, a lot of them are good, but some of them aren't. Yeah, like, the, 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 remember the clip where Soda almost died? He was playing with randoms. Yeah, but they're, but they're not randoms. They're the roaches, man. Uh, you know? Yeah. They're just, uh, they're Asmon ball viewers. Well, I shouldn't say randoms. People that he doesn't, that he is not familiar with. Oh, we have not vetted these people at all. Like, there is no <laughs> selection process. There is nothing to it other than, do you want to join the guild? Uh, yep, all right, you're in. There it is. Yep. I you need to get to leveling. I need to join for one day so I can make like 3,000 gold in one day. Yeah. Just be like, hey, roach out, go to the gold for asthma and then just leave. Yep. Yeah. I collected uh, 900 off your name. Wow. Very good. And Holy then, shit. And then I've collected 2,500 <laughs> just off of my name by writing people's names on like, my faces. And uh, I took one of your ideas. Yeah, I love writing. Yeah. It's a good yeah. One, right? Everybody gives me money. Whoever donates the most, they get half of the pie. Yeah. And then I did it for so long, people forgot about that. So and then you just took the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, oh, all right, guys, guys, there you go. All right. yeah. was, oh, look at the time. Yeah, like, oh, fuck, guys, gotta get to that ZF run. Yeah. Here we go. This shit is such a scam. That's yeah, crazy. It's good. But I'm using it for good. I'm buying, uh, like, I'm, I'm gonna attempt to get Mojito and Angel Sam their staff of Jordans uh -huh. so they can gear up. Cause that's the thing that I really think people need to understand about Classic WoW is that gear. it's really not about, and people will disagree, I don't care, it's not about getting you geared, it's about getting everyone in your group geared. Yep. Because as much as you're relying on yourself, you need to rely on these other people as well. And like, eventually you'll get to a point where you're good and everything else is icing on the cake. We want to get a point to where everybody's good because that's where the most overall DPS will occur. Mm -hmm. So that's what I'm hoping to get towards. I'm hoping that mentality is shared, but we're streamers. Everybody has an enormous ego, myself included. And uh, I know people are trying to min-max fucking hard, but I am not going into any raid without my free best. I'm, I'm going to get every single fucking piece. Yeah, that's another thing. If I already killed anybody in the raid, I, I, think, I think the pacing is such. The reason I die in the water and stuff like that is because I'm pushing ahead of where my gear and my level is and I, I i know that too i'm like i can do this without the gear but but honestly if i played it like i've been playing final fantasy 11 and i fished and I, I i got the money together to actually be able to one shot these mobs it wouldn't matter if i had two or three of them i could just one shot them you know and that's if i had entire agi gear i'm liable to like two shot everything and the pressure is a lot less so, and I've been thinking about that. I'm like, part of the, the hardcore grind that I totally am trying to ignore is the money 
but the the money is a thing you you need like right now i'm skinning other people's corpses because to me it's like free money on the ground you know but like that's that leather it's important to me like i realize how important light armor kits actually might be even the sm even the crappy ones yeah, even the crappy ones like are, are are better than better to have than not. Use them later every time you have armor at all, because it's just you know it's more armor that you didn't have, and I didn't really realize how valuable that is. So I skinned these bears, just to you know just to make fucking uh, armor kits. It also power levels leather working, which is kind of weird. And, and like I don't know, I guess I could get better more. I could have bought um, coarse thread and made improved armor. Like, the cloak isn't bad, but I still have a better... I mean, I don't need it, though. What I need is, like, two gold so I can buy gear. I'll probably forget. That by this plant, you forget. Who did I kill? I don't remember. Oh, shit. Yeah, I have no idea. I have no, no clue. <laughs> Yeah. If you kill somebody, we'll go, lol. Yeah. If I kill somebody, people would get really upset. Oh, yeah. Yep. yeah, he's, he's, he's got really weight. Like, 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 like something about him. He, he brings out the, like, the worst in people. They want to take shots at him immediately. I don't really understand it. It's something about his personality. He, he, uh... Yeah, it's something about his personality. Yep. Yeah, that would be like, uh, I knew, that... I didn't believe those Genshin players. Yep. I should have listened to the haters. Yep. I mean, I'm being dead ass. Yeah. Everything I do is an the microscope. Everywhere I go, bro, it's yep. exhausting. Yep. Oh, fuck. Well, if I get someone killed, they'll be like, it's okay, I mean, you are nothing on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's okay. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I didn't even kill the Anders, and people yeah. were still saying it's my fault. Oh, yeah. Which is insane, because I actually, I reviewed the mod, and uh, she told me that she told me she was going to go to fight some of the mobs, uh -huh. and I'm like, that didn't fucking happen. So I searched her pod for 30 minutes, and I found out where she said it. I was in the bathroom. Ooh. So she said it while I was AFK, and she knew I was AFK because she was making fun of me for pooping for two minutes. Ooh, yeah. wow. Okay. Yeah. But so that's it's actually her fault. That being said, I did still send her a, a best in slot level 29 blue rail for 100 gold as an apology. Uh -huh. And I also uh, helped power level her back at the start. So they did it at 17. Oh, who cares? That takes like an yeah. hour. Yeah, it's, it's not, not a big deal. deal. It's like no, five hours. No, but it's not a big deal. It's actually less. If I kill somebody above 40, oh my god. That's taking away three days of their life. Yeah. 17, that's an hour. Even, I mean, fuck, Canute got to 15. It's two and a half hours. Fucking Canute. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm gonna probably level up a second character and then I'll do dungeons with that second character. Fuck yeah. But I'm not gonna tank. I'm just okay. not gonna do it. Yeah, fuck that. The people, the tanks always die. Yeah, main tank? They always main die. Bitch. Main bitch, yeah. yeah well, it's that. just they're disposable. <laughs> it's like you see the, the hunters and rogues and uh, mages just roaching out, running away. Yeah. Oh, God, get out of here. Meanwhile, the boss is killing the tank, killing the healer, killing probably one other DPS, and then they're gone. Yep. Yeah, that's what happens. No, I understand it very well. Yeah, I'm like, no fucking way. I saw him a warlock. When, when, everything I'm, starts I'm getting, out. when everything starts getting out of control and you're the tank, what do you do? You, you can't. You, have to you can't do out. anything. You have to leave. Is that just Petri? Yep. Yeah, you just you leave. I guess pop a cool down, leave just party. Leave. Petri, just, Petri. Yep. Leave, leave out of, leave the whole party, leave everybody to die. Do people yep. have like a leave party macro? Or it's like you have to do it manually? I don't even know if you have a macro. I just took it off, right? Yeah. I mean, I, yeah, I have no idea. You probably, I'm, I'm sure there probably is a macro. But yeah, that's what I would do. I just immediately leave the party because it's like, I'm not going to die for somebody else's mistake. Like, I'm, well, I'm not okay with dying to my own mistake, but I'm especially <laughs> not okay <laughs> with dying to somebody else's. Yeah, you know, so I, I try not to. Uh, like, that, that bear is I mean, 17. Okay, so I said this before the podcast, so yeah. in full disclosure. I genuinely feel like there's no way to die if you're not an idiot. Well, like, that's the thing about classic wild player. Right. Yeah. yeah, but a lot of people that have died recently are, like, um, considered, like, really good 
wildfires exactly. or speedrunners. Yeah, yeah, they like, can be idiots. Like, being yeah. a good player doesn't mean that you can't be an idiot. Yep. Yeah. Right? I've like, been an idiot. I've either been AFK or just popped, yeah, you know, happen. just popped. Like, mistakes happen, but these are dumb mistakes. Yeah. Like, yeah. It's, everybody's awake, everybody's alert. And by the way, if we start raiding and people are just, like, just woke up and they're getting in there, fuck that. Yeah. They need to warm up. They're like, like reading hours. donations while they're healing. Absolutely not. Like, yeah. turn that shit off. Because, like, oh, my God, dude. I, I know the, 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 the rage of soda. I have seen that on many people. You know, he did that to me when I played Dark and Darker. Which I really need someone to stop reacting to my shit when I'm playing casual games oh, casually. Yeah. Oh, my God. That is, you know how frustrating it is to have your own gameplay scrutinized when you're just fucking around with your buddies? Good God, it's so fucking frustrating. <laughs> Maybe you, should have, maybe you shouldn't be having fun on the job. Huh? Yeah, don't play. <laughs> <laughs> That's the problem. Yeah, I guess. Fuck. Also, uh, I met uh, Poke the other day. Uh-huh. Uh, first time talking. Actually, a really nice, fun guy. I really? Yeah, I've been is he show. leveling? Yeah. He is. He's 60. What is he? How? Yeah. Holy is, shit. Is CG boosted? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, what, is, what does that mean? ZG boost. So at oh. level 50, you can start getting these things called ZG runs, where you just AFK in a raid, and you'll have a mage like soloing the trash mobs, and you'll get like a free level every hour and a half. Oh damn! And you just pay them to boost you, so you get a really good mage, they boost you. Can you do that in hardcore? Do people do that? Yep, there? people do that. Yep, a lot nice. of people do that in hardcore. A lot of people. I'll do that. That's yeah. how they're doing it. So fast. They're all hitting My 60 by ZG team boosting. Team. I wondered. I was like, they're all cheaters. Yeah. Yeah. They because are. They're they, cheaters. Uh, 40 to 60 is like, hell, most not. When I legitimately on stream yeah. reach, reach 60, which I won't, um, it, when I legitimately reach 60 on stream and I would, won't have used ZG to do it, I think I'll be really happy. I bet all these people do it. Yeah, because I was like, I know all these exploits and old shit that used to work, and I like, I wonder sometimes if they fixed it. They did, they, they didn't, they haven't. Yeah. You know. If you have money, like, if you're a streamer, it's easy. Straight up, like use buy all the nexuses, four yeah. to fifty, done. Level fifty, GG, AFK. I don't think I'm gonna do any of that. I think you should try it, just to see it. Like one run. Well, it'll work like, you should it'll just, like, just experience bars. the game, and if you die again, then you should power level. Oh yeah, that's what I've been doing. Is like. I'll Our play, I play the levels use. myself, yeah. like I have played to level 42, but it's like, I'm not going to do it again, I've already done it. Yeah, I get yeah. it. Yeah. yeah. I mean, me personally, I just like going into Naga Caves, uh -huh. and then I just fight three at a time, and I shit something. I, I don't know why, the questing is so fucking boring. And like, there's yeah. no reason why I'm not getting more combat experience being on Terminator, speaking of which, Terminator's getting an anime, that's great. Terminator is getting what? an anime? Yep. What? <laughs> yeah, on Netflix. Oh Make my it god. Terminator anime. Uh, and oh, hold on, I have a whole series. Avatar: The Last Airbender is getting a new series. Terminator anime series. Devil May Cry is getting an anime. I'm very excited about that one. I am a former edgy boy who thought Dante was the coolest dude. Cause he is. <laughs> yeah, I'm so excited. I'm more of a Virgil guy. Also, dude, the soundtrack, the Bury the Light. Oh yeah. Have you heard that shit? I mean, yeah. Oh my god. What a fucking song. Yeah, that's gonna be sick. And then also, uh, AOT ended, uh, which, in case, you know, you've seen it, it's like, it has Code Geass as an ending, but it's worse. Uh, we're just saying, I can't believe what they did to that series. A lot of people like it, that's fine. But oh, I did you like, not like the Code Geass ending? Oh, yeah, you don't like it? Huh? You didn't like Code Geass? No, no, no I, I did, but I, what'd you think about the ending? I don't oh, really I remember like, Code Geass well. ending is incredible, you know? It was like one of the first ever animes to do what it did. But AOT yeah, really I just, liked it. You just didn't like, like how they did it in AOT? Yeah, they just copied it. Yeah, because the characters sometimes just don't make any sense at the end. Obviously, mm -hmm. the beginning of the series is so goddamn good. Like, I, I'm a big ending guy. You know, I'm not going to enjoy sex if I get an STD afterwards. And that's kind of how it felt oh, like watching yeah. it too. You know, 80% of it was good. The last 20% just made no fucking sense. Uh, and uh, it pissed me off. Could have been way better. And maybe I'm being a hard ass, but I just feel like AOT had so much more potential. It's still like a 7.5 or like an 8.2. But it could have been like a nine, nine and a half and above. It just had so much potential. The one most beloved series of all time. I just, I just wish it was taken a little bit more seriously. But uh, it's because I'm a fucking loser. Uh, I was saying something important. And then I got distracted by. I only hours. watched like the first one or two seasons of Attack on Titan. You'll love it. Same. You'll yeah, love it. Stuff, You'll yeah. fucking love it. Really? Oh, it's so okay. goddamn good. Yeah, yeah. like and, and I, I liked what I saw so far. I thought it was really good. Yeah, I enjoyed it. So it, it has a lot of. It's very complicated because it starts uh -huh. off one way. 
yeah. in a way, it goes a completely different way. I can kind of see that happening. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Because uh, I don't know if this is true or not, but this is a straight up, I could be speaking on my ass. Mm -hmm. I was under the impression that there are articles that say it was supposed to end in the first season. I was told it was supposed to just everybody dies. Because, yeah, you know, and I can see that. I can see that. Echo. Yeah, I, I kind of expected that's the way it would end. I, I yeah. assume that probably, probably it's not exactly what happens, but you know, like I don't, you know, I don't know you. Yeah, I, 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 I thought I heard something about it was gonna be a tragedy and everybody was gonna die, and I think that was what we're gonna do. Like, uh, like a comic got killed. A yeah. Comic, yeah. Everybody just gets fucked with water. Everybody's dead. And the series is like 15 years old. You haven't seen it? It's, it's not that good anyway. Don't worry about it. Okay. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, it is so good. There's so much action. Now there is a character in it called uh uh oh god. I think it's Reinhardt. I think. Reiner Reiner. Reiner, who's incredible from the episode one to the end. Uh and it's a very complex series, but like it has a really good thing going on. Like the first two two seasons are like battling in mechs. Uh-huh. And then season three and beyond is like uh political. Okay. So it becomes a political th a thriller. Yeah. Which uh I don't like at all. Not that it's not good, I just I just thought it was. We have enough of those in real life. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. No, I, I don't know. I, I The last anime I watched, I watched the cyberpunk anime. Have you all seen that? Yeah, it was great. I've seen some of it, but I didn't finish it. I, wa I actually, I finished it. This is very rare. I actually finished the show. It was a good show. I was surprised how good it was. Yeah. Because I played cyberpunk recently, and it was actually, a, it's, it's really fucking good. Yeah, I was amazed. Did you, were you beat it? Oh, okay. Did you get the, did you get a superpower? Slow down top one? Uh, the Sand Devastating? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I did. You like that shit? Yeah, that's kind of right there. Yeah, did you you do that? No. So, you can be driving in a car, and then you can activate this chip, and you slow down time. Then you can get out of the car while it's driving, kill three people, then get back in the car, and yeah. continue driving. What the fuck? It is so cool. Like, so, the game, like, I remember whenever it came out, it was, like, such a piece of shit, it was a joke. Yeah, and I then, that. yeah, yeah. It was a, it was one of the uh, game. It's still game a piece of shit. Apology, you know, picture. it's still a piece. And, it's uh, not, a, it's not a piece of shit, but it's still like a seven. It's a seven. It it's boring. It, Grand Theft Auto Five is far, 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 far more entertaining. It is way, way, way older. Especially, I had just finished Starfield at the time, and that game, it really, um, it was like wearing wet socks. Yep. Yeah. That's basically what Starfield was like. <laughs> yeah, it was really, really, and bad. <laughs> really <laughs> fucking bad. I didn't play it so bad. I didn't play it either, but I, I watched streams of the day it came out, and I remember just being like, this is so not interesting, I don't know what the fuck's going on. Yeah. I remember playing, yeah, I, I remember I would be playing it, and I'd be asking myself, what are you doing with your life? Where's your life going? What's going to happen in the future? What happens after you die? What happens five minutes after now? Are you going to be any farther along in anything in the next 30 minutes? Dude, what? you have the game? Yeah. Like, I mean, it's just, it's I know it was depressing. like, I'm sure it was like the beginning, but it was just I couldn't do it. fucking yapping about I couldn't like, do it. boring shit. I hate when games like that try to like world build by just referring to a bunch of different things you've never heard of and expected yeah. to remember. Oh, yeah. Yep. Thank you, bro. It's yeah. so annoying. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, like I don't care about that stuff. I, I don't care. Yeah. You can pay me to care. Like, I don't know what this yep. is and I don't care. Like, I don't I care. Like, I don't have to care. You gotta watch a 30 minute exposition about the yeah, last like, like, years. Like, this is what scares me. This is how I heard this is how I heard about Final Fantasy 16 is 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 his biggest problem is it's a really fucking good game, is what I heard. But oh I want that floating debris, but it's such a dick move to step in on him. I'm not gonna cause some drama with the boomer. Damn it, I was looking for that and he got it first. So annoying. It's cold out here on the beach. Why is it relevant to the 
care if they're part of gameplay. I just yeah. don't. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Like I like stories that don't exist. Those are my favorite. Like Dark Souls. <laughs> oh, like yeah. just a bunch of like. Yeah, and, and if you want to figure out what happens, go ahead. And if you don't, that's fine. Yep. Like I will say with the Cyberpunk <laughs> story, that shit is crazy. Like I was actually surprised. Like I is the end of the game. The the beginning of the game. Oh okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. How much did you pick? Uh, the um the four like outrider rift? outrider. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I forgot what even what it was called, but yeah, something like that. Yeah. Nomad. Yeah. 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 There you go. That's the one I picked. It was sick. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was really good. Like I, I like that. I, I just I hope that more games come out that are like actually good story games and aren't super safe. You play you know? Fable. What say what? Fable. I only played the first Fable. Yeah. I didn't play, I haven't played any of the other ones after that. I heard Your skill has three. increased. Two or three was good. I liked Fable 3. It was okay. good. Yeah. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm super biased. I, that was just like the only game I had. Played like 13 times. I just want to see, like, I like games whenever I know that they're not pulling punches. You know, I, I hate games and I hate content that, like, I feel like it's safe. Yeah. You know, it's like you can't see some crazy ass shit happen. Dude, you want to see crazy ass shit? What's that? Oh Watch a World of Warcraft classic stream where people in Discord voice at 4 a.m. The uh, shit they're saying is crazy. Oh, I know what they're saying. They're yeah. in my guild. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh my god, people are so out of pocket in that shit. Oh yeah, I know. And, and like, you've got to remember, like, they're toning it down because they're on stream. Yep. You know, like, so if you go and you talk to them off stream, like, this is like a whole fucking thing. Yeah, the like, internet has turned people crazy. Like, I fear them. It's like the earth isn't, like, really round. Yeah, I know. I, I, like, I don't want to hear about all that stupid ass shit. I don't want to hear about it. My mother, she'll sit there and she, like, her one complaint these days is, 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 is the conspiracy theorists. She's like, I can't live in fear. I feel the same way too. She's like, I can't live, I can't live in fear. Uh, I I can't, I can't fix it. I can't fix the deep state. I can't do any of that stuff. And some of the stuff is so crazy. I don't want to hear it anymore. And I was like, yeah, I kind of feel the same way. I like David Icke and I will pay attention to the stuff. And I do feel like I want to know what's going on with the deep state or whatever. But I mean, I don't want, or, or like, like, like hollow earth or any of this other stupid shit. I don't, I don't want to hear it. I, 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 I don't want, I don't want to hear about people's sexual orientations. I, 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 I used to really believe in something called privacy until it became a joke after, after the Patriot Act and, and everybody's Palantir now and all of Facebook got sold and, and Zuckerberg and all the all the lunatic fringe theories and stuff. I don't want that as a part of my life anymore. The reason I ever got into it in the first place was 9/11. That was it. I was convinced before that it was some kind of inside job. I was I was convinced before anybody ever ever even said a word. I was like this has to be our country. This has to be our government. And then I was like, and then it took four years of sleepless nights and freaking out and watching the internet and learning before I come to, I came to my best friend and I was like, they did this. And I really believe this. They did this. And I believe this. And I have swallowed it hook, line and sinker. And I don't know if it's true. I don't know these people and I don't know, you know, oops. Uh, one second. I, I screwed up. Hold on. Oh, damn it. Damn it. The, the tucker keeps decharming and it's so annoying. I've got to feed him to something else. It, uh. Let's go to the beach again. I like the beach area. It seems safe. It took me a while to find a safe area in this in this zone that seems like spread out enough where, where it's good. I could go fight the tiger, but it could go badly. I mean, I, I guess I'll fight that one just because it's on the way. Uh, or I'll take the bird. I prefer the bird. The bird seems to be nut-hugging the tiger, but yeah. Oh, 
phone and like you know it's a bunch of stuff yeah the aliens oh absolutely as plastic law players like i remember um i i actually so i said <laughs> jump up Excuse and down me. this is the guild name jump up and down if you think the 2020 election was rigged and a few people didn't start weren't jumping there's only a, a few people that started jumping and i was like no no turns out the server was fucked Oh. I was like, there's no way that yeah. everybody isn't jumping if this is classic World of Warcraft. Yeah, that was, um, you were in, you were in Stormwind. We were in the cathedral. Yeah. And there were so many people there, we despawned every NPC in the city. That's, uh, yeah, you know what he's speaking so of. It's, it's that underlying right-wing thing I talk about in video games like Rust and WoW all the time. They're all right-wing boomers and they drive me fucking crazy. I don't have the political, I don't have the political, uh, affiliation like that. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. And they're always on about some fucking thing about Trump, like, when it's been just five years of the worst media any, any, any Americans ever, ever received. You want to say something that isn't, like, like a troll about Trump? Uh-oh. Uh oh. Uh, come on, man. I'm oh, I'm paralyzed. Of course. God damn it. Come on, man. Good, good. Get on him. Get on him. Good. Get on him. Good, good. Get on him. Oh my God! I fed it to it anyways. That's all right. He's going to kill me. There. Get him, get him. Yes. Go, go. It's annoying, but get on him. Get on him, get on him. I've got to heal. I, I, I'd rather dodge him. The tiger's a lot stronger than him. I feel like BST cannot take a hit at all. It feels it feels squishier than White Mage. It's so dumb. It's so dumb. Oh, what, oh, you want me to go oh, talk to him? I was like, what is it that you want me to do here? It's so annoying. Honestly, I think the level 1 to 20 is a lot more fun than the rest of the game. And that, that might be also another reason why I keep dying too, is I'm like, yeah, the, the further you go, the less and like, the less fun it is, and the more of just this I terrible, li luck, linky, right? linky aggro grind. It's, you know, like, D Duskwood is really fucking nasty. I don't know. I like Ashen Vale. Ashen Vale's good, but it's also scary. Some little, like, little way. Oh. Yeah, I got the fly point. Yeah, and I, I don't know if I did the beach sea creature, but yeah, so cool. Like, yeah, I think we're good. Oh, no, I can go get the turtle. I'll just go get the turtle right now since I'm out here. Yep. Sit. That went well. That could have gone badly. We had everybody log off. It's like, I, we don't we don't want to kill people accidentally. We want to kill them on purpose. Yeah. So, we like... Out of force. Make it fall in the pit. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, I like that. Yep. Instead of the anvil, uh -huh. people will lag out, run to the pit. Yeah, yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> I do not think the election was rigged in any way or fucking form. You want to know how I know? The Georgia Republicans said so. I'll use the Republicans as my source. How's that? The Georgia Republicans said so. And that's how I know that that is not fucking faked or whatever, like like rigged. The Georgia Republicans crucified him and said so, you know. I'll use their fucking party as the proof. How's that? That's the twisted world for you. You want to know how I know that election wasn't rigged? The Georgia Republicans sued him successfully. And, and kicked his ass for even re remotely saying that they fucked around. The Republicans did that. And that's how I know. Oh, the I real, know the real Republicans. That, if you kiss you, do fall in the pit. No. Yeah, if you're in Iron Force, you fall in the lava pit, log out immediately. 
Uh, and then unstuck, and then you'll pull one out. What is unstuck? Oh, like you message the devs or whatever? Like this is like unstuck, wait, this is, un this is unstuck uh, bug before, right? I'm not even sure. I have no okay. idea. I've never even had to do it. Because I, I got stuck once before, but I thought I had to like, mess, like, I don't even remember what I did. Yeah, there's a button that you used to have to message the developers. Oh, okay, that's what And it is. now uh, they don't have anybody uh, that cheer. does uh, customer service there. What? And so, yeah, yeah, they don't do that anymore. You don't need to mess them here by the light of the loom. Yeah, yeah. If you get somebody like that, that's like, it's like a miracle. Okay. Usually you'll like be logging in between your characters and they'll wait until you're logged off. To I'm like too you. low oh, to go sorry, get that stupid thing. When you're on. <laughs> by the way, can't solve your problem. Thanks for playing. Make sure to fill out the survey. Give us fives. Yeah, if I were ever to die to a layering or a bug, I would I'd be furious, man. I'd be so fucking upset. Yep, because they, they won't fix it. If you die hardcore, you're done. You're done. You're, it's, it's over and that's it. It's it, You're done forever. I'm really hoping fear just kills me. Really? Because if fear kills me, I'll be like, oh, that's okay, buddy. Uh -huh. you, a learning experience. You did your best. You exactly. Really tried. I can't be angry at Sarah. I'll yeah. be angry at Kungus. You should have seen, like, the comments. Everybody was so mad at Miz whenever you died. You were you're so... Well, it was like actual like were, this was like a, 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 they were like we hate him in real life like yeah I, I get I it I knew everything bad I knew about him this confirmed it it's like, like, I, I, like as a viewer it's like okay sure it's like okay a streamer does something it's like annoying like you guys have to start over I don't want to watch this like I get that yeah but some people were like fucking deranged like it's not that big of a deal it's like a character in a video game and it's not even your character Oh yeah, no, it's, this it's is crazy. Oh, it goes even farther than that. Like, and in my opinion, like, yeah, obviously all that's true, but I'm sorry, but I love revving them up. I do. I love farming them. It's so fucking funny. Why? To me. You want me to rev them up right now? Go ahead. I think he did it intentionally. Oh my god. I'll tell you why? Hey, here's a question. <laughs> Which no. death do you think was a better fake, Epstein or Miz? <laughs> <laughs> So here we go. Here, here's my tinfoil hat theory. He was trying to find yeah. a clip of him saving Emmy. You'll notice he cast challenging shout at the last Dude, split second. Dude, this is second. actual like conspiracy <laughs> yeah. theory Facebook post. At the last split second, he cast challenging shout and in order to seem like a hero, but he right. forgot that if a caster is locked onto a target, he doesn't reason, reason, yeah, it doesn't reset. Then he goes through. What's the only thing she died to? One fireball. Yeah. And he was trying to be a hero, and in, in turn. He became the villain. Yep, that's right. That's right. It was all according to plan. And <laughs> So annoying. I've been calling uh, Miz and Jimmy Kip lately. I <laughs> think it's so funny to me. Because Miz right now, I can tell. He was fucking so bad at me. Yeah. Was so, yeah, I fuck with him so much. It's my favorite one, because he has such good reactions. We all keep for like five hours and then we're on Rumble. Dude, that's so, what I tell him. Like, yeah. I'll be like, you know, like, people do these things because you react to them so strongly. He's like, oh, I know, that's why I do it. And it's like, he just keeps doing it, gets mad. Yeah. <laughs> it, it, he's, he's my favorite. He's, he fucked me a lot, too. But I, I love fucking with him so much. And, uh, yeah, he was so bad. I snitched on him, like, bro. What 40, people die on public oh, yeah. And then when my stream people were like, no, they would have shot anyway. It's like, yeah, we, we know, we're, we're joking. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. But some people were actually <laughs> mad at you about this. Like, wait, did you actually think Soda wouldn't have heard? I know. If Tech didn't do that? Yeah. Oh my god, like, it was going to be a secret. Like, Miss, why are you leveling a new character? It's the same as your old character. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Just in case. Yeah. I was bored. Yeah, yeah. It's, I think a lot of viewers can't tell, like, one when like streamers are bantering between each other especially if it's like angry banter and two like a lot of the jokes i think just like they actually like take it way too seriously yeah no nah, I, I like me and business relations a lot it's like uh it's like a use of siblings mm -hmm. it's like i feel <laughs> like i'm back at home it's oh you so should good. see like any of my comments like because a lot of the basically I know Emmy feels bad about this, right? Like that guy that got harassed. Oh yeah, I, I felt really bad when he said that. Like people were sending him like basically death threats. Yeah, those were my viewers. I was like, bro, yeah, it's those not mine, that fucking serious. Like it's just what he was do. just there. Yeah, and, like, but he like could... even if like he like I don't even remember like the analysis. Like even if he like say he did fuck up, like he okay, he could he could have done he could have probably saved you. 
if he had played it perfectly, but like it's not really. Yeah, but it's like no one played it perfectly. Yeah, here, exactly. So. And, and but he did. Uh, but yeah, no. It's like <laughs> but he did. Crazy. Like, <laughs> I mean, the, the YouTube comments are the ones where people are like really unhinged. Dude, Those I I always ones. just say like YouTube comments are like not people like oh. past like the top ten. It's like. Every time, like, someone, like, some streamer or content creator, like, tr talks to me and they're, like, about YouTube comments, I'm, like, bro, like, those are not even people. Like, you should not be reading those. That's, that's how I feel. I don't know. I think the people saying, why do you care so much that Emmy died? Oh, here's one. Fuckers. Here's one. This is about Emmy. This was on my channel. I love how Emmeru caused a fight between two men without even doing anything. This is a woman's bro. passive. I'm gonna throw up. That's so <laughs> weird, bro. What the fuck? It's just the normal classic WoW community. What the uh, fuck is that? Fuck them. Yeah, any, like. I'm kidding. Well, when I say YouTube comments, I specifically mean like Twitch channel related YouTube comments. Or mine. That's a Twitch channel related. Uh, we should do a dungeon. Yeah? Yeah, all three of us. I'll tank it, Abby heal it, you DPS it. Oh god. And then we'll get uh two DPS, we'll get like Jimmy here and like uh, young Jeff or some shit. Yeah. I think that'd be cool. Why don't we we could get Miz and then like I could I could do something wrong and yeah. then frame Miz. Yeah. That way it looks like it was his fault and then he would have killed all of us. Why don't we? That would be crazy. Can you imagine? That would be so crazy. Is who who is who is Miz killed? He's um, killed Emmy, killed Fandy. Do you kill, no, he didn't. How did he kill Fandy? He's oh, just naming random people. I've been told it so much. No. Dude, Fandy was, yeah, Fandy was getting, oh Fandy was getting boosted and she like zoned out and got killed. What the heck, Fandy? Yeah. You got first faded, yeah. I've seen it so much. Yeah. You did? I've seen it everywhere. Like, Miz yeah. killed Abby, Miz killed Fandy, why does Miz hate women? Yeah. <laughs> what, what is he doing? No, Fandy was playing, I think, with one other person. Mm -hmm. And she was just grinding oh, mobs. Bro. And, uh... She like wasn't even like looking at her health bar and just died. Oh no, Jesus! I'm Sometimes just, you get got. I'm just that's like, just what happens. Yeah, I'm just like the rest of them, man. I'm like the other roaches. Oh yeah, I mean this is the uh, I I just I can't wait until the guilds like I I want to start seeing the death clips and everything because like what we do is like whenever somebody dies in the guild, we, everybody just like spams rip bozo, get him the fuck out of here, uh, kick this loser out, like get this piece Dude, of shit out of our guild. It's gonna be so fucking crazy. And then we just kick him out of the guild. We're like, this isn't a guild for a loser. <laughs> <laughs> I did this to my buddy last night. It was so funny. She got to level 19. Yeah. She died to like a pig. Like a fucking pig. Ooh. Everybody's like, oh, I feel so bad for you, Pitsy. And I'm like, yeah. no, you are fucking dog shit. Yeah. <laughs> Go again. Oh, it feels good, man. It does really, I will admit, it does really suck when one of your buddies dies that you were looking forward to playing with. If yeah. Wake were to die, that uh -huh. would devastate me, because I want to play with Wake so bad. Right. I also do want to do a dungeon with Miz, I genuinely do want to, because that, that also pissed me off when he died. Because we were like almost right there, and I could have played with him too, which fucking sucked. I also want to play with young Jeff. Yeah. Really bad, so if they die, I will feel horrible. I just need people to stop dying. Like, just stop doing stupid shit. Go in groups, don't do orange or red quests, just... Fucking just slow do it the down. green quest, just quest quickly, yeah. and just do it, get them done, and then take it slow and steady. Do yeah. the quest quickly, but everything else, just chill. I mean, I, I mean, it's generally like, like I did all of Scarlet Monastery, every single uh, graveyard, cathedral, armory, uh, library. We did it in 25 minutes. That was that was that was like 40 percent of our like, XP bar. And it yeah. was easy. It wasn't even fast. It's like walk through, kill them all. Uh, it, it is very hard to just like, you know, like it's like bow, 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 caves. They're just not designed right. You walk in, everything's on you. Just no, you just don't aggro it. That too. You just don't aggro the mobs. It's that easy. I don't see how people have such a hard time with this. Well, I mean, you just don't aggro the mobs. Well, there, I get into a scenario where like somebody's new, they go on a boat, they, there's nothing on the oh, platform. If you're new, if you're new to the game, it's totally different, right? Yeah. Like I don't blame new players. Like. I see, like, I, and, and I always get shit for this sometimes because, like, I'll tell people, like, you know, it's like some deaths are, in my opinion, kind of stupid, right? Like, there's, like, things that are kind of buggy or things that, like, you only would know this works this way if you... Yeah, the two cats were kind of buggy because I couldn't see the second one. It's like just some... 
I couldn't see the second one. They came at me, they came at me from the same angle. Then when I realized it was two cats and ran, it was it was over, and that felt buggy to me. But I mean, like, but th- but that's how the game is. They'll stack inside of each other. You can't do anything about that. That I'm a lot more willing to forgive than pop aggro. Mobs inside of each other is weird. I'm okay. I'm okay with mobs being inside with each other, of each other. That one I'm willing to forgive the developers for for some reason, but the pop aggro I'm not. The pop aggro is like, no, you should create a shield around me when I'm not moving and standing there, especially when 